Hey, how you doing? Brian Howard here, BKH Credit Group and BKHCreditGroup.com. And before I get started in the video, the first thing I want you to do is I want you to subscribe to the channel. You really, really want to subscribe to the channel because after I give out some information today, you want to make sure you catch the next video. You make sure you get notified about the next video, which is going to be the major follow up to about what um, I'm going to announce today. And that question is, is how to build business credit super, super fast and super cheap. Uh, one of the struggles with business owners is. And they're starting a business credit building profile, particularly when they're trying to build a profile without using their social security number. They're, you know, they're using their EIN number. One of the major challenges is finding vendors that that report to the bureaus and also finding vendors that they actually want to buy from. Now, remember, now, when you come to our system, I mean, we have a ton of vendors. Uh, a lot of vendors that we don't even mention here on 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 our social media channel. I mean, there are a lot of vendors out there in addition to the Uline and Grangers and and Quills of the world. Those are all great vendors. But just know when you come in and work in our program, we have quite a few more vendors with a lot more products and services that you would like for your business. But that's not what this video is about. This video is about how to build your business credit super fast and super cheap. And particularly, we're talking about your Experian business report. And I know everyone is familiar with the big dinosaur known as Dun & Bradstreet, but sometimes uh, a lot of you are overlooking the Experian Business Report. And this is the report that a lot of lenders and credit issuers use for credit cards and lines of credit. You know, that type of cash credit money that you want. Dun & Bradstreet typically is vendor credit and trade references are typically what reports on uh, your DMB file. And that's not a bad thing. You just need to kind of understand uh, the the dynamic makeup of the two. I mean, they're both business credit reporting agencies, but they to a certain degree report uh, different types of data. But I'm gonna get right to it. I uh, don't wanna keep you a long time. So what we're working on, and when I say we're working on, we don't have it finalized yet. Uh, I am in, I'm in negotiations um, to be able to put you in a position to where you can use things that you're already paying for right now and have them report on your business credit report. So let's just give you an example. Right now, I'm working from my home office, okay? You clearly see I'm working from my home office, right? But in my home, I have lights, I have water, I have utility, I have my cell phone bill, a cable, things like that. Why internet, Wi-Fi, et cetera. These are all things that while they do serve a personal use, they're also necessary for my business. So if I'm paying those bills on time, shouldn't I get credit for those toward building my business credit? I think so. Absolutely. And that's what's about to happen. So what we're about to do is we're about to have it to where you can take your cell phone bill, your Internet, your cable, your gas, your water, your landline phone, your mobile phone, and you can actually have that reported to your Experian business credit report because you're still using those as part of your business. And how is it going to work? Basically, we're going to have a system uh, that's going to link directly to uh, whatever, the, you know, whether it's your gas, water, light, whatever company it is. And it's automatic. Our software will automatically download up to the last 24 months of your payment history. And then we're going to report that to Experian twice a, twice a month. Right now, right now it's twice a month. Now, if you live now, we already have about 1,500 different companies already in our in in our software. Now, if you live in I don't know Kansas, somewhere in Kansas where they film The Wizard of Oz in rural Kansas, and you know, and they have you know Dorothy and Toto's uh, water company. We may not have them in the system yet because they're such a very small company, but in a rural area. But we have a manual process to get companies like those reporting as well. It just takes an additional couple of weeks. But we're we're adding every day, every week. We're adding more and more utilities and cable companies and different things like that across the country. So if you got Xfinity, Comcast, AT&T, Sprint, you know, all the major names, I mean, we already have those in. And. Um, I don't want to go into pricing, but it's going to be super, super cheap. When I say super, super cheap, I'm talking about less than 10 bucks a month. So for less than 10 bucks a month, you're going to be able to report up to eight different trade lines to build your business credit. And here's where it gets even better. Obviously, you're building your business credit with your experience. In addition to that, 
what we're going to do is we're going to connect your business credit profile with different lending opportunities. So as you're adding those trades and they're and you're building up the business credit and you may have some other trades that, that are, you know, that are reporting on your Experian file as well. And you're building up your Dun & Bradstreet uh, and your Equifax as well. We're going to have a group of lenders in our network that's going to be able to access, you know, your business credit reports just like they do on your personal side and come to you and offer you lines of credit and different things like that based on the strength of your Experian business credit report. So if you haven't been paying your water bill on time, you need to start paying it on time. Your gas, electricity, don't be late anymore because now you're going to be able to take advantage of paying those bills on time. You know, so as we get ready to move forward in 2019, as you see, the business credit world is expanding, it's changing uh, in a good way. I mean, some things not so good, but this is something that's very good for us as business owners because now we can start out a file with Experian very, very easily. We know how to build a Dun & Bradstreet. We know how to get um, the vendor credit. I mean, that's that's easy. I, I've done a, a ton of videos on that, but this is going to be a game changer. This is going to be a game changer. You're going to be able to get up to eight trade lines reporting on your Experian business credit report. And it's only going to cost you 10 bucks a month. But in the meantime, you need to have a credible business set up. Uh, you just can't have a, a business bank account and an EIN number. You know, go up, you know, go and set up, set up, set up a credible business. Go set up a credible business. Make sure, you know, you follow all the steps to set up a credible business. If you don't know all the steps and you still need help, then obviously we have programs that can help you with that. But this is for this, the serious business owner that's serious about business and business credit. I always talk about the CFO mentality. I'm looking for CFOs, chief financial officers that want to grow their business exponentially, financially. You know, that's that's what I specialize in. You know, that's you know, that's what we do. We help you grow your business exponentially, financially from a business credit and funding standpoint. OK. All right. So what you need to do is you need to make sure you subscribe to the channel. So when we actually release this new product or new service, you can get first dibs on it. Uh, I know you're probably asking, well, when is it? When do I expect it to be done? I will say before the year is out. OK, before we go into 2019, could be sooner. Uh, I hope it'll be sooner, but I don't want to give you a date. And then if we're not able to meet that deadline, then y'all be mad at me. And, you know, Brian Howard's the bad guy, but, you know, BK's greater group because he told us something was going to be ready on this date. And it's not I understand that there are agreements and negotiations and different things that have to be done from a legal side and different things like that. And once we get that finalized, then we're going to be off and rolling. I'm going to make sure you have all the right information you're gonna, I'm gonna have, make sure i have a link for you so you can get signed up right away and start building this business credit okay all right so with that being said i'm gonna sign out this is brian howard signing out for bk's credit group